Now I do want to break down the tropics real quickly. First off, we have something to monitor and it could impact your East Texas weather as we head into next week. Disorganized storm system just to the south of Hispaniola right here. That is going to be moving into a more favorable environment here over the next couple of days. About a 70% chance that this develops into some type of tropical storm or hurricane here over the next five days. About a 30% it happens a little earlier than that within the next 48 or so hours. Let's talk about the models here. There are a few models that are picking up on this storm, but the general consensus Consensus is that this will go into sections of Louisiana. Now, is this going to change? The answer is probably yes. This is still six, seven days out away from landfall, but one of our most reliable computer models does take this over the Yucatan Peninsula and into sections of the Gulf of Mexico, either making landfall in Texas or Louisiana. Now, just based on some of the data that I've seen this morning, I would say Louisiana sees a better chance at seeing a landfalling storm early next week, but it's got plenty of fuel to work with across the Gulf of Mexico. And look at this water temperatures well into the 80s. That's almost bath water level, and that is just acting as jet fuel for this storm to form. So still a little too early to pinpoint the exact track of this storm and conditions. Unfortunately, I just showed you those sea temperatures. They're very favorable for a strong strong tropical system to form and you can find out more on a live stream on our website at one o'clock on Wednesday and you can find that uh, live stream today at KETK.com. Thank you Carson.